Hey everybody, today I'm just making an update on Uniswap, what's coming up and uh, you know the dates and general info. Uh, at the moment there isn't uh, <clears throat> one of these coins that have really released all the information out of the upcoming ones so I can't do a dedicated review on a specific coin so I thought I'll just cover what I've added and um, what to keep an eye out for. You know as per my previous video Uniswap is looking a bit shaky at the moment but I think a bit of patience and things will pick up again. So from the top um, Piranhas uh, it's actually listing tomorrow they said they're going to add the liquidity as soon as the sale ends uh, as you know I'm invested in that so we'll see how that's going to go it's a bit worrying to be honest just because of the state of the market but uh, the adrenaline is worth it then um, space mine they said they're gonna give an update today actually finally you know it's been quite a while since they were supposed to do their pre-sale um, the reason for their wait was actually so that uh, Unicrypt they could work out something with Unicrypt so their uh, liquidity is automatically locked which is really good actually and I'm gonna keep it at semi-pro if I make it bold so that's one to keep an eye out for uh, I think whitelisting is actually done so if you whitelist it for that it could be worthwhile to participate then Lambo DGENs that's still the same waiting for info I just noticed I made a spelling error okay <laughs> so for Kylan um, that one I want to do a full review on it eventually so for that we will wait and see as more information comes out I know the pre-sale is ongoing at the moment so <clears throat> next one warp finance so on their website the countdown timer finished but it's just a link to the light paper so over here there's more information uh, your light paper <coughs> token launch so here they're saying they're not going to have any investors and it's just uh, earned by active participation which is quite an interesting concept and uh, could do well uh, I shared on my Twitter actually the link to participate in their airdrop so if you participated in that that's a good step and this will be a project to follow closely I'll be following it closely and I'll share on my Twitter any links or activity campaigns that they're doing to, to get involved <clears throat> so I'm quite bullish on warp actually and uh, good I'll keep that uh, rating then next one umbrella network this one um, I spoke to the admin today they say they're going to be raising approximately 1 million so they're auctioning 50 million tokens uh, at a minimum of 0 0.02 dollars so I'm not a big fan of auctions because you know in Uniswap there's maybe a bit too many DGENs it's good to be a DGEN but a smart DGEN and there's a lot of dumb DGENs that'll just ape into the auction at a super high price and then everything's just wrecked so it makes it not worthwhile investing in most auctions but uh, they've got 400 followers the hype isn't that much but it's still interesting they're an oracle which always gets hype so this one is just one to monitor for now and they said the sales only in six weeks well that's quite a long time to wait you know uniswap could be in season five by then so i'll just keep watching that Yield looks quite good. There's quite uh, high profile uh, investors that are investing in it. And their TrustWap launchpad is on December the 7th. So there's some time to go by then uh, that we keep it as interesting and to monitor. This I figured, I tried to figure out how to pronounce this and I realized it's anarchy. <laughs> but it looks quite hyped. They've got quite a lot of members in their Telegram, which passes our. One of our main hype tests um, the website's interesting it's you know revolving around uh, gaming uh, reminds me kind of of a video you know uh, what the, I forgot team 3d so they're having a, a competition basically on gleam where you can win kind of like Binance where you can win uh, slots to invest in their pre-sale which is quite a bullish uh, 
technique for them to use in my opinion and this is running until the 4th of December so I did share that on my Twitter so if you go there you can enter that um, UNN finance this I haven't got much info on it uh, I know it's, it is quite hyped they've got quite a lot of members on their telegram uh, it seems like quite a big one less of a Uniswap degen play more of a proper ICO which I don't know if that's something I'm too interested in <laughs> but uh, yeah, that one will be probably a dedicated video later on then Royal Finance this one seems strange um, 350k seed round and then I actually spoke to the the dev and he said they're raising 1.5 million which I think is quite a lot for such a coin that doesn't have that much hype at the moment so in that case I'm not too bullish on it at the moment and I'm just going to monitor for now but I might remove it later on um, then the last one flaming farm it's probably the worst name out of any crypto coin I've seen and they've been pretty bad ones and this one's pretty cringe they're actually having their pre-sale and I checked and checked this 6.5 ethereum they've raised in since <laughs> one person sent what the hell they sent six ethereum and it's just a con it's not a contract address which as per my video is a super red flag plus I I'm gonna open the website so just prepare your eyes if you're epileptic don't look I thought they were ugly almost, <laughs> just maybe my slow internet. Okay, this is uh, also one of the worst websites I've seen. Um, it's just a farming token. And they're not raising that much, but I mean, it's, it's nothing special. And you can see how much they've raised so far. I mean, there's nothing good at the moment about this. So, this one is super not pro. I'm actually just going to remove it. I literally added it and I'm removing it just to give some insight on it just in case anyone was, which I doubt, was thinking of investing. So, yeah, that's my video for today. Hopefully I can cover specific pre-sales um, in one video with a review. But uh, as I said, there's not much information on these coins. Uh, you know, not enough info to make a full video on. But uh, anyways, I'll see you tomorrow.